Three women in Maine are a source of inspiration for many, especially as we get ready to mark the 4th of July. And as Michelle Miller reports, their show of patriotism is unwavering. If you drive down Main Street in Freeport, Maine, any Tuesday morning, this is what you'll see. Carmen Footer, Joanne Miller, and Elaine Green proudly waving the stars and stripes. Why do you do this? Because our country came under attack back on September 11th in, in 2001. And like so many Americans that day, I want to do something. On that tragic day, the three women walked up the street from where they live and decided to hold up the American flag. The response was so overwhelming, they pledged to do it for one year. One year turned into two, which turned into three. Twelve years later, the Freeport flag ladies have never missed a Tuesday since 9-11. They're happy to have that gentle reminder that this is their country, freedom's not free, and it makes them feel a little more connected in that moment. That flag is the signature of this country, and where she flies, people know that, but the thing they have to know is that when she's not flying, there's no freedom left. We got an email from the National Guard. The flag ladies don't just stand on Main Street. They answer dozens of requests to go into schools, churches, and community events. Thank you very much, ma'am. They even travel five hours to greet flights leaving and returning from overseas. Thank, Thank you, ladies, for Thank coming you. out. Thank you. Thank you. Elaine will never forget one soldier who was heading to Iraq in 2004. His father called me about three to four months later to thank me. Um, he said, my son was killed. He says, but when he left, he was in a very dark place. He said, but I got a call when he arrived in Iraq telling me he met some ladies. He said, Dad, I'm going to be okay. He says, because I met people worth dying for if it has to be. And his, and his father, <clears throat> his father was calling to thank us because we gave his son his dignity <clears throat> and that he didn't die in a dark place. If I never did another thing in my life, if that's all I ever had done, then it would have been enough. And until every soldier returns home, the flag ladies pledge to remind us of that price of freedom. <laughs> <laughs>